Here's why who you work with really matters. So I have a client selling the condo in Flushing and she's moving to a house over in Mineola. We knew the property in Mineola was gonna take some time to close because they had to go through probate. So, you know, I sat down with her and we identified how were we gonna navigate these two transactions. We found a great buyer for her condo in Flushing and we were able to negotiate a really nice term lease uh, with, the new land, with the new owner. Basically, she was able to stay in that property for as long as she needs to. We got a very favorable rent and he was gonna uh, renovate it and rent it anyway. So he's happy to have her stay until she's ready to move. And then we also knew that the house in Mineola was gonna take a while to close because they're in probate. We don't really know when that's gonna happen. We got another de uh, deal on that house where we could rent, move into that house early and rent from that owner until the probate is finished. And we close on that house just in case she has to move out of the flushing property because that owner maybe wants to start renovation. So we really covered her from both sides and I was really able to sit down with her talk through all these things. She felt super comfortable, you know, with both options and having some stress off of her plate. But who you work with matters. If you don't take the time to sit down and understand people's frustrations and stress and what they're looking for and what's going to make them feel happy, you could run into a situation where she might not have anywhere to live now because the second property is taking longer to close. That would not lead to a successful transaction and it would lead to a lot of stress for the client.